Hello there beautiful people, I hope you're doing well and welcome back again to On How channel. For people that don't know, my name is Anas, I'm working for you. So if you have any questions, any video requests, make sure to drop them below in a comment and I will be happy to make a video for you. And for people that do know, welcome back and please be, please be a witness to that because I made over 100 videos now, over 50, 150 videos about Shopify customization they were requested by you guys, I mean subscribers. And some people not even subscribers but I'm fine with that. Just a like button, that's all I'm asking. Or actually, if you are interested in Shopify customization, you want to be an expert, why not subscribe to the channel, man? I don't have anything to sell. I don't sell any courses, never will. I don't have any paid memberships on the channel. Everything I do create, the calls on the videos, I provide them completely free on the channel. So it's a win-win situation, but I'll let you decide and I respect your decision. Just a like button if this video helped you out. And even if it didn't, just drop me a comment, I would be happy to make an update for, you, for you or give you the proper information you need to do the thing you're trying to do. And here I am again back with another requested video which is how to make the header menu items font uh, bold on your Shopify store and I mean both actually like the active links if you are accessing contact us page uh, it's going to have only the uh, menu that you're accessing as bold or if you want to make everything bold this video will help you for both so if you want to add only the active links which is the one that you page that you are accessing it's going to be bold on the main menu in the header or if you want to make everything bold as i said this video will do actually both for you and we will do that again by using our own custom codes two codes actually one for uh, the make them all bold and one for just the active link that you are accessing or the page or the menu you are accessing. And without any more talking, let's just get to it. As you can see, this is the Shopify dashboard. I have here down team, which is the one I do demonstrations on. So every video or trick I do share, I do demonstrations on down team because it's the most requested one and also is the most used one. But if I scroll down in here, I have every other free, most used free teams, which is refresh, spotlight, taste, sense, and trade. And if you are wondering why is that, because I do actually try each one of my tricks on all of these teams behind the scene. I don't do that in the video, so I don't bore people, of course. And I do try them behind the scenes, so I'd make sure that it works for all of them. So even if you're not using down team, using one of these should work for you just fine. And I have to say this in the beginning, because I know you're going to see me doing it on down. And you might be thinking, well, maybe it's not working for the others. No, it is. And here is your peace of mind and without the way let's just get to it and show you how to make these ones font size bold as you can see so it's going to be uh, also if you want the hover effect like like this on the menu i already made that video every little thing you see in the shopify store i did it in tutorials the scrolling announcement bar with the search bar and shine effect on the buttons the shadow effect with the rounded corners every little thing it's too many to mention Every little thing on this video, on the Shopify store, sorry, I did it in the video. So if you saw anything here, you think it looks good, you want to implement it in your Shopify store, then it's already done and posted because once you see it here, it means I already posted that video because I don't remove the changes I do in tutorials. Same as this one right here, which is making these ones bold or also making just the active ones that's bold. At first, as I said, I will show you how to make all of them bold. So we'll keep this page open, do the trick, come back and see it in action. So the first thing you're going to do is get back to Shopify dashboard. If you are already in Shopify dashboard, click on the three dots on the left of customize and click on edit code. It will take you to the code editor for your Shopify team. And on the here, we need to find a specific file. Instead of looking at the folders, use the search bar. And again, I have to mention this. So it's going to be either base.css or team.css or style.css. But most of the teams now they use base.css. So in my case, I know it's base. Simply type in base and here we go, base.css. And after that, scroll all the way down. Let me drag this, it's a huge file. Okay, we are in here at the bottom of the file and we need to create some space to paste in some code. Simply click from the last thing in here and hit enter on your keyboard. Here we go, we are in completely new line in here. Because as I said, we need to paste in some code. And to get that code, you need to hire a developer. I'm just joking. Scroll down to the description box and you will see a link. Name it as code. Simply click on it and it will take you to this page right here. We're going to see a very short code, as you can see. So this one will do the trick for us. And this one will make them all bold 
not the active links or sorry actually this code is for both so <laughs> so the first one the first one is just to make the whole thing like the whole menu items bold uh, the phone will be bold and the second one is only for the active links and let me show you how to do that so select the whole code in here right click copy we will get back in here and let me zoom in, in here so you can see clearly and paste it at the bottom of the file so let's just say you want to do this only for the main menu not the active links if you want to do that simply remove this one remove the second line remove it and actually make sure to remove this one as well uh, the dots the front of span in here make sure to remove it then we will click on the save button and we will get back in here reload the page and check it out the whole menu here is bold as you can see and if you want to do the same but only for the active links that you are accessing let's just access contact us for example as you can see now they are all uh, bold but we are accessing the contact us page if we get back in here and select the second line that we did remove from the code simply select it copy and get back in here and replace the previous one with the new one the one that we did keep from the previous call simply remove it and paste in the one that I did copy now click on the save button we will wait for a couple of seconds we good let's just reload the page and see check it out now they are not bold but the ones I'm accessing are actually bold if I access the catalog here same as you can see the other ones are not bold but this one that I'm accessing bold which is only for the active links that you are accessing and that's how you make the menu items font size bold on your Shopify store and if you have any questions make sure to drop on below but for now I think my job is done so thanks for watching catch you on the next one